I think I kind of threw the Freedom Caucus under the bus, but in reality, who did I think was kind of behind the blackmail originally? I thought it was people in the Obama administration, specifically Joe Biden was kind of in charge of investigating me. And um, it seemed like it was it was people connected to Joe Biden, especially in people in the military and um, maybe intelligence community, maybe people from Fort Meade. Um, probably a pretty small group. I don't know. I mean, maybe not. Um, I, I still don't know what the blackmail was. Um, so I feel like I'm throwing the Freedom Caucus under the bus, but at some point what happened is I started talking about it and then people started getting mad and I thought that you guys kind of changed up who was in charge of things because of that and that would be why the Freedom Caucus is who's kind of in charge now because it's like, well, the Democrats were the ones doing the blackmail and then the Republicans came in and took over when, but unless the Republicans were working with the Democrats, which I think is very, very possible. Um, but I still feel like I threw the Freedom Caucus under the bus because they sure have had a lot of power, but I don't know where that power comes from, but it's, it's probably because that power is such a small group of people that actually know what's going on. That's my guess, but um, they love their country and a lot of people love their country and even Ilhan Omar loves her country so much even though she loves other countries so much and um, I, the, the problem with removing sanctions on Iran specifically is some of us look at Iran and think we might have to fight them so um, a lot of people don't look at the world and think I might have to fight you um, because, and so if you, if, if, you, if you might have to fight someone you definitely don't want to give them the resources to fight you right before they fight you. Um, so um, that's why we can't remove the sanctions on Iran right now. Um, so the, the, the problem is I keep looking at the things that these people are doing and I'm like, okay, I agree with that. I agree with that. I agree with that. And so it's like I'm not completely – your, your job disapproval rating is, is very – you haven't, you haven't messed up that much it seems like. It seems like you guys do a good job usually – but you do mess up on a lot of things um, because you are the Freedom Caucus. <laughs> it's crazy we got libertarians in charge right now um, during such an extreme crisis.